It is interesting to note the change in tone of the Russian buzzer. Which sounds much more like a beeping or two-tone beep. So this is uh, received via a, a Norwegian radio station, uh, uh, SDR, the uh, LA-1D, Historical Society. Very weird. It is interesting to note that the buzzer change in the past few weeks and it's not always the same it sometimes beeps it sometimes buzzes yesterday was back to a buzzing and i was telling someone that it's kind of interesting to note that it changed as things are kind of getting complicated with russia does it have any significance or anything to do with it who knows is it an updated system? They modernized the buzzer. This is a modern buzzer. <laughs> we'll see. We'll monitor it in the uh, next few uh, days and weeks. I tried to receive it here in uh, Montreal, but I'm not hearing it at all on uh, 4625 right now. As, uh, that would be probably the best time for me to receive it if I had to receive it here in Montreal. Interesting. So, UVB76, although that's not its real name technically, um, but um, the buzzer, the Russian buzzer, has become the Russian beeper, or the Russian two tone beeper on 4625 kilohertz. If you don't hear it uh, at home, you can uh, simply go to one of the Kiwi SDRs online in, around Europe or the U20. Probably works on the U20 receiver also. We probably can even check it out right now if I go to U20 SDR. Click here. Start the audio. There we go. And let's have it here for 625. There we go. So bizarre. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up, thank you for watching.